Airlines are hoping to get back on schedule tomorrow after the Federal Aviation Administration issued a ground stop delaying or canceling thousands of flights around the country today. News Channel 3's Bianca Ventura live in studio now with a look at how the outage continues to impact Palm Springs International. Bianca. Hi, John. Understandably, we saw a range of emotions at the Palm Springs Airport earlier today from friends and family being excited to pick up their loved ones after hours of waiting to those that were frustrated from the cancellations and delays. Oh, no, here we go. Melanie Highstad flew into the Palm Springs International Airport this afternoon from Canada. At first, I thought it was weather. And then I found out from one of the fellow passengers and the airport that it was actually a computer glitch. The FAA's ground stop has since been lifted, but delays trickled through the day. We've seen a handful of cancellations at PSP and dozens of delays for several flights coming in and out of the airport. It was uh, short and sweet. Usually we're delayed quite often, so it's to be expected. Many passengers we spoke to tell us they were somewhat prepared for setbacks after seeing the difficulties with holiday travel. We are delayed an hour and 10 minutes. It was um, really not too bad considering what inconveniences everybody else across the country is enduring. George Medneck is flying to Santa Fe a week from now and is bracing himself for more obstacles along the way. Who knows what we're going to encounter in that uh, adventure. And the Federal Aviation Administration says normal air traffic operations are resuming. And to get the latest information for flights coming in and out of Palm Springs Airport, you can visit palmspringsairport.com slash flight status. Live in studio, Bianca Ventura, News Channel 3.